A second challenge is that business owners often don't pay enough attention to their intellectual property, mm -hmm. patents, mm -hmm. trademarks, copyrights. Uh, a business owner can just start using a name or a logo and perhaps in the interest of not wanting to spend a lot of money on legal fees uh, or just b because of, of the pressures of running their business, not consult with an intellectual property attorney and have trademark searches done and if necessary file appropriate trademark applications and they just go merrily along spending a lot of money promoting their names and their logos and, 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 and their brands and then one day the cease and desist order a letter arrives from an attorney for a large corporation with lots of resources to litigate and that is a very unhappy day. And I would imagine that takes on more importance now with the internet and the websites. Very much so. Do you get involved in that? Uh, I do to some extent. Uh, one thing I, I, I think, and I try to get this across to business owners, lawyers are not fungible. Not every lawyer knows every area of law or is, is skilled in every area of the law. I routinely work with intellectual property attorneys uh, in areas such as, such as uh, protecting names, uh, determining what protection should be sought, and this is, this is just a very, very critical issue. As you said, I think the, the Internet has uh, made it even more important.